I am Dr. Sarojini presenting you a lesson in English beneficial for B.Ed course and the teachers in CC model that is digitalized. This is model lesson 2 on peace and harmony for segment to help the learners to begin reading. I shall read the story of the first segment of your lesson Peace and Harmony. Look at the pictures and listen to understand the story. Once upon a time, in a very thick forest lived many animals, birds, snakes and insects. They lived very happily. They roamed about the jungle and played together in the open field without any fear. The peacocks were very proud of their dances but admired the melodious songs of the cuckoos. The elephants enjoyed watching the fish swimming in the pool. The python that were blessed with long bodies spoke well of the fine fur of the flat-footed rabbits. The tiny ants, which are always busy, tickle the dark buffaloes. They often held musical nights in a large open field. The elephant and the deer danced. The miners and parrots sang. The tiger and the bear exhibited gymnastics. They called the moon and her friends, the stars, to be the guests of honor at their musical evenings. Children, rewind the video, go to the beginning of the story, look at the pictures and read the story yourself. Read the story silently. Look into the dictionary for the meaning of the words you don't understand. If necessary, you ask your teacher for the equivalent word in English, what you know in mother tongue. Discuss in your groups. You will have to answer some questions after finishing reading. Children, 
study the questions carefully and answer them. Listen to the questions now. What are there in the forest? Who dance in the forest? What did the ants do? Now look at the answers and compare yours. A word of advice to the student teachers. Student teachers and teachers, stop the video, rewind it to display the picture story and mute the audio of the story prior to the task of silent reading. Guide the students when they ask for any clarity in understanding the story. Help them to refer to the dictionary and translate words in their mother tongue to English. Extend live model reading on necessity. Let the students express orally and in writing words and short sentences. Look for my next model lessons. I shall be shortly posting. See you soon.